In my many splendid career, one thing I've done is I created a residential treatment program. I didn't get into this in my biography called the Life Process Program, which is, comes from my work in my books, The Truth About Addiction and Recovery and Seven Tools to Beat Addiction. It was successfully implemented in a residential treatment program, but as in so many great marriages, that one ended up in a lawsuit in federal court in Southern Iowa. C'est la vie. Uh, I made a few dollars out of that experience, but then we separated and I own the Life Process Program. I'm now involved with an Irish entrepreneur in using the Life Process Program as an online approach. Uh, there's been quite a bit of evidence to show that therapy presented electronically by Skype or video conferencing is more, at least as effective as ordinary treatment for the basic reason that you're gonna get people more on board the less they have to do. If they can stay home and talk to somebody and you have a successful technique, they're more likely to do that. Um, and so we're trying to expand that to the life process program. We have gambling, we have drugs, we have alcohol. We're gonna spread it to love. And we're having a presence on the internet where that program is now being used uh, to, on an outpatient, on a coaching basis. That's the right way to say it. It's not treatment, it's coaching. When you're using it on an internet, you don't have control over people. And I believe at the same time, you asked what's the future of addiction. When virtually everybody recognizes the possibility of addiction in their own life, when we spread addiction, well, it can be gambling, it can be shopping, it can be eating, people start saying, you know, I do have some addictive tendencies. It's hard to believe you don't es escape in one of those areas or another. Um, maybe I'd like something, you know, I'm not going to go to the Betty Ford Center probably for that, although there are residential treatment centers for all of those addictions that I mentioned. You need something that's more accessible, that makes use of modern the internet and electronic technology, and I'm trying to fill that, that gap. We have a good, we have the program online, we're, we're testing it, we're, we're applying it, we have people who pay us money to do it. And so I see that as the future as the exact opposite to residential treatment, but as a treatment that reaches out to people where they live and work as being the future of addiction treatment, I'm, I'm hoping and ha happy that I'll be involved with that.